Five days after Cyclone E-Day slammed into the South African country of Mozambique, emergency crews are still struggling to reach victims. Rapidly rising flood water 20 feet deep in some places is making for dangerous rescues. People are climbing trees and rooftops to save themselves. This woman says her home was destroyed in the floods and her young daughter, who was in bed with her at the time, was washed away. The cyclone damaged or destroyed 90 percent of Mozambique's port city of Beira before dumping huge amounts of rain on Zimbabwe and Malawi. Aid agencies say the humanitarian emergency is getting bigger by the hour. 400,000 people at least have been displaced or, or made homeless. Thousands are desperate for food, clean water and shelter. Ongoing flooding is making burying the dead difficult. Once the scope of the disaster becomes clear, Zimbabwe's president expects more than a thousand people will have lost their lives. Tina Krause, CBS News.